Hey guys, welcome back to the Parkiverse. This week, I bring you guys something truly special, allowing us to take our Android customization from our home screens even further by bringing back lock screen widgets, a feature which Android dropped many many years ago. But before we get started, don't forget to hit that subscribe button so you don't miss out on the next one. And of course, as always, don't forget to submit your live wallpaper and home screen requests right from within the Epic Live Wallpaper app. Just head over to the live section and then click on the request button. And remember to boost your favorite ones using both the heart and the booster buttons here. Now before we jump right into it, just keep in mind we're going to be using an early access app to bring back this lock screen feature to our Android phones. So depending on your phones, you may find that it has a couple little kinks that the developer still needs to iron out. But having said that, it is one of the few apps which allows you to set your installed home screen widgets direct to our lock screens. That is, even if it does require a little bit of patience. Now this one comes straight from the Play Store, the promptly named Lock Screen Widgets, a paid app well worth checking out. Now the setup for this one is super easy, just follow the on-screen guide and make sure to allow it all of the permissions that it needs in order for the app to work correctly. After which, you should be welcomed by a screen much like this one. Now the app itself is actually split into two different sections. The first one for lock screen widgets and the second a widget drawer. So feel free to check out the drawer yourself. However, here for this tutorial, I'm going to be focusing on the lock screen section. Just simply toggle it on and using the plus button, we can load in any one of our pre-installed widgets. Selecting them in exactly the same way as we would for our home screens. And using the preview button, you'll be able to see exactly what you have set right now. Now having said that, if you do want to customize the overall look and feel of these lock screen widgets, make sure to check out the settings option. Here, you'll not only be able to adjust the background color, size and even layout of the widgets, but also its animations. So it's definitely well worth checking out. So once you've added a widget to your lock screen, the first time you try and access it, you're going to be prompted by these on-screen directions, showing you how to resize and manipulate the widgets direct from on your lock screen. But simply put, using two fingers, you want to tap and hold on the widgets. This is going to allow you to both enter and exit edit mode. Now as for the sliders and handles, they can be a bit temperamental, so try and have a little bit of patience as you're adjusting the widgets on screen. Now as for managing the widgets, all of it's done from the lock screen itself, with us only ever really using the app to add in more to the list. Now as a quick side note for you regulars of the channel, if you're wondering if KWGT custom widgets work on your lock screen, rest assured they do, and they work exactly the same as they do on our home screens. Well, kind of. You do need to first add them in through the lock screen widget app itself, and to customize it, from on your lock screen, you want to tap on the KWGT layout followed by unlocking your phone, taking you straight into the custom widget maker itself. And the rest is simply business as usual. Now before you guys run off, I do have to mention, using this app does come with a few limitations. Firstly, it goes without saying, you want to make sure that you disable face unlock. Otherwise, instead of staying on your lock screen, your phone will instantly unlock, making this app totally useless. And secondly, there is a slight hanging of the widgets whenever you unlock your phone, almost like a ghosting effect as the widget slowly fades away. Now if you want to lock up your Android apps and even trick others to think they're broken, why not check this video out next. If you like this video and want to see more just like this, make sure to like and subscribe to help support the channel. And why not check out some of my Android customization videos. See you next time on Into the Parkiverse.